Hey guys! Welcome sa aking YouTube channel. And for today's pag-aaralan natin ang ibig sabihin ng coefficient of variation. Pag sinabi natin coefficient of variation, ayan po. So, mamaya intindi natin yan kasi ngayon hindi pa natin maiintindihan yan. So, ito yung formula na ginagamit. Coefficient variation is equal to standard deviation. Ayan, nakikita mo yan. So, mamaya na yan, maintindihan natin yan. So, gayon guys, ngayon guys, ito na. Ito yung gagamitin natin formula. Coefficient variation equals standard deviation over the average or mean of population times 100. So, ito na yan. Nasubstitute na natin sila. Coefficient variation is equal to 2.59. Paano naging 2.59? Dahil dito. Nga pala guys, ito yung, yung given natin. Which has the greater spread of relative mean? Ano daw yung pinaka greater? Yung, yung height ba? Or yung weight? Or yung weight? Ano mas mal greater spread of relative is mean? Height ba? Or weight? So, mamaya intindihin natin yan. So, paano naging 2.59? Dahil dito sa standard deviation na 2.59. Paano naging 71.4? Ulitin ko ah, itong 2.59, ito yung standard deviation. Ayan po, standard deviation. So, ayan po yung kinuha ko. Paano naging 71.4? Ito po yun, yung average. So, average height is 71.4. Then, isi-simplify natin yan. 2.59 over 71.4 times 10 is equal 3.63. So, pag kinalculate natin yan, ayan po lalabas. So, meron na tayo sa height. Sa height ay... 3.63 Very good Paano naman si weight? So, paano naging 17.3? Dahil dito Standard deviation is equal to 17.3 So, ito yun o oh. Standard deviation Paano naging 1 183 dahil dito kay average na si 183. So, kukopyain natin yan. Then, ita times natin sa 100. Dito, 100. So, ang magiging sagot ay 9.31. So, ang tanong, which has the greater? Alin sa mga sumusunod ang greater sa mag-relative dun sa, ma sa min o malapit sa min. Ang sagot dyan ay ito. So, this is the greater spread relative to its min. So, ito ang sagot. So, ngayon, pag-aaralan natin, ano nga ba ibig sabihin ng yan? Ano ibig sabihin ng coefficient variation? Pag sinabing coefficient variation, ito ay ginagamit para i-compare yung dalawa o higit pang variables. Ano ba yung variables kanina? Yung height, tsaka yung weight. Yan yung variables. Especially kapag ang units, yung, yung, yung weight tsaka height ay magkaiba. Ay magkaiba. Ulitin ko. Ito ay ginagamit sa pag-compare ng dalawa o higit pang set ng variable. Kino-compare yung isa o higit pang variable. Ulitin ko. Ano yung coefficient variation? Ginagamit para comparing two or more set of variables. Yun yung height or weight. Ulitin ko. Ano yung coefficient variation? Used to compare is used to compare or two or more 
set of variation, especially the the measurement unit is different. Ulitin ko. Kabisa doy nyo muna. Very good! Ginagamit para i-compare yung dalawa o higit pang set ng variables, especially pag ang units ay measurement ay magkaiba. Yun po yung height tsaka yung weight. Measurement ay magkaiba yung height tsaka weight. Kinocompute yung, ayan, kinocompute yung coefficient ng height at yung weight. Gets? Ulitin ko ah. Ano yung coefficient variation? Hindi mo na get. So, pag sinabing coefficient variation, is, ginagam, is ginagamit para i-compare yung two or more var variables. Two or more variables. Get? Set of two or more set of variable especially when the unit measurement is different yun yung height tsaka yung weight ulitin ko ano yung coefficient variation is the set of use is use ano yun is use when comparing two or more two or more set of variables especially when units of the measurement is different gets nyo yan? kabisado nyo nga it's used to comparing two or more sets of variables especially when the units of measurement are different ulit, ulit ano yung coefficient variation? Very good. It's used when it's used when comparing two or more set of variables are are especially the units of measurement are different. So yun lang guys. Sana nagustuhan yung blog. Thanks for watching.